now? Are you thinking now? <laughs> I wish I could say um, what I think of Mingyi in one word, but I can't because she has a million words. My school canteen food is very nice, so I can't wait for today. Especially because there's going to be some interesting hair, which you'll see later. There's a big poofy thing at the, at the top. Very messy, like all fizzy, fizzy, fizzy. Today in my school we did uh, something like that. That's the rebound height of a marble when you release it from a height. They put a piece of cloth there to trick us in the apparatus. Actually, we don't need to use the piece of cloth. So I'm glad I didn't. So it's pink. It's supposed to make me look older and more mature because I apparently look like a B2, which is a good thing because it's cute. Like rabbits. <laughs> that girl, oh my god, she talks, she talks, she talks, she talks, she talks. But okay, like, the good thing is she brings that energy into the shoot also. And she did a very good job of keeping herself entertained. So you don't have to like try to worry about her mood sinking because with that girl she took some happy pill in the morning and it's going on until I get a headache, you know, she was just going on with the people. And it's good for her because we need that energy on set. This time in the toilet I was trying all the balancing shots. Because I feel that um, this kind of dress, right? Yeah. If I move my legs uh, a bit, you can't really right. tell because it's covering all the way to the cow. So I thought maybe um, I, if I could like show off the legs part more, I'm using these to help me balance. Because there's a lot of different poses you can do while balancing, so it's easier. I mean, it's like more, there's a bigger variety you can do, right? whereas opposed to just doing this and this and this. <laughs> yeah, photo shoots are fun because there's a lot of things you can learn from them. Like, so far, with, for the past three photo shoots, I've learned how to relax my face, uh, open my eyes bigger, tilt my chin up, and most importantly, relax my fingers. Yeah, so, okay, I've got a lot of learning points from each photo shoot. She really took our work to heart. And I think she really did the homework. Of all the girls, I think she made the most remarkable improvement because she went from like really on the border and nearly being cut off to like, wow, we're glad we kept her. It was really fun because now I get to balance between um, two ledges and behind there's a staircase. So I think the background is like really quite interesting because normally you see people like posing in the garden or against a wall or maybe sitting down on a chair. So this time I, I got to balance which I, I quite like it. Yeah, it's very fun. Because it's not you're doing it this way so you look as if like you're gonna... Uh, no, 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 don't, don't demonstrate when I'm demonstrating. Okay. One of the things that we thought about her was that she looked... always looked like she was in Primary 2. You know, she... And of course like if you see her on set you know why because she's like doing your homework. My normal handwriting is nicer. Yeah, this because my hands are cold. Giggling around, talking non-stop and all that. So, um, so we decided we need to give her something more mature, something more grown up. Don't crumple the dress, huh? Better not touch. <laughs> we thought it would be a nice contrast. Want to see my muscle? <laughs> and it worked because I think she looked really hot today. Um, we thought she would freak out with that freaky hair, but she didn't, and in fact she embraced it, so good for her. Good for her. I wasn't really sure how to work it uh, per se because of the hair, so because the hair is a bit, is a bit different, and also um, the gown, you have to make sure that it looks good, like because it's not really the normal cutting you'd see, this one is mid-calf, not like mid-thigh or, or knee. So yeah, I have to take into account all these kind of things. She has a quality, you know, we really might be seeing more of her in the future in the sense that she will be, she might end up a superstar, you never know. If she, she promised me that she will remember me if she, if she became a star, so fingers crossed. But okay lah, she just needs to talk less. I'm, let me be the one who talks more because, you know, don't take away my title, please. Should I be talking?